I go, are we here? I go. No. Now. Oh, please go. Crossing the river Pra. Between the Sultan and the Central region. These communities are all cocoa growing communities. They grow a lot of cocoa in this area. Now, when you say Ghana cocoa is premium, we're talking about or uh, it's organic. We're talking about how we process it. Now, the cocoa from the farm, they cut the pots and then they take out the seed. Now, when they come back, they drop now the fermentation stuff from the farm. What they do is they use from the first one, they use the leaves of the plantain to cover them. After covering them for a few days, they come, they bring them home. Then they put them on this stuff. From the again, this is from the palm front. It's a palm front. They fix it and then they, they dry it. They start drying it. They use only the sun, no oven to dry. Now after a while, they come and mix it. They go through like this. Now, while they are doing this, what they do is to pick out the bad ones and throw it away. They do this over and over until it's very dry. When it's very dry, you can hear the chocolate scent. And it's more uh, nutritious than when it gets to the factories. Now, Ghana export this for foreign exchange. Even though it's a private enterprise, the cocoa farmers, they are private, but this seed, when it's like this, is government of Ghana property now, because you cannot buy this from the farmer without license from the Ghana Cocoa Board. And the farmer cannot pack all this and carry it and go to the border of Togo or Burkina Faso or Ivory Coast, say sell it. He will be arrested and prosecuted for smuggling cocoa. So you sell it to a licensed buying company from the Ghana Cocoa Board. And this is the cocoa. So this is the process you go through before we get the hot chocolate and the chocolate we like. So as this is a process, it's not dry yet. When it's very dry, it becomes very smaller and uh, more brown than this. Yeah. So this is it. So Nana, this yeah. here that you picked up, this is not living here. This is what they use to make the chocolate or is it the black? Oh, black no, 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 no. It's the process of drying, so it's drying now. It is yeah. chocolate. It's drying. Yeah. All this is chocolate. All of this is chocolate. Oh, yeah. Oh, of course. Okay. Now, from here, you get a chocolate, so all this is chocolate. The only time that the, the farmer goes through and see if it's very bad, he throws it away. So that, yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. So that they don't get the bad mix with it. Yeah. So they don't have to crack it open and get it? Oh, I talked about it, it's a pot. Yeah. You crack open, yeah. and, you, oh. and then from the farm, this is the final preparation, drying, and then bagging. No, 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 I'm saying, Taking this little thing here, break it open. That's what they do to get the chocolate? No! no. Oh, I, oh. This is the seed. So it goes to the factory oh. to prepare. And then when you prepare it, then you get a chocolate. So this is the whole. Oh, they use the seed yes. as a part of the chocolate, maybe. Oh, okay. The first time I've seen this. So. I now know. <laughs> that is it. So this is the ingredient, the main ingredient. For the chocolate, the without the cocoa seed, you will not get the chocolate. Now I know they use the seed. Now yes. So we will be stopping at one of the farms just to see the one, and then our final remove.